Hi children, today we're going to learn about numbers, right? Numbers from 1 to 10. Here we, you can see that here we have to count the objects, right? And then we have to trace the number. It says that we have to count the objects and then we have to trace the correct number that is given in the box. So in the first box, you can see that we got stars, right? First of all, we have to count that how many stars are these and then we have to trace the correct number in front of it. So with me, let's start counting that how many stars are these. This is star number one. This is star number two. This is star number three, star number four, and then star number five. So these are five in number, right? So in front of it, you got two boxes. One box contain number five and one box contain number four. And we have just counted and realized that these are five in number. So five is the correct answer and four is the wrong answer. And that is why over here, number five, which is the correct number is traced because our task is that we have to trace the correct number given in the box. So now let's see what we have beside it. In this box, we got our favorite meal that is burger, right? Who doesn't love burger? So you, first of all, we have to count that how many burgers are these and then we have to trace over here the correct number that is given in the box. So with me, let's start counting that how many burgers are these. This is burger number one and this is burger number two, right? So these are two in number. So in front of it, you got number three and number two and three is not the correct answer while number two is the correct answer. So let's start tracing with me the number two. Start from this point, make a round curve, keep moving down till you reach the bottom. Now make a slant line from left towards right. So we are done with the tracing of the number two, right? Which is our correct number since these two burgers are two in number. Now let's see what we have in the second row that we have to count and then we have to trace the correct number. Here we got our roller shoes, right? So first of all, let's start counting with me and see that how many roller shoe are these, right? So this is roller shoe number one. This is roller shoe number two. This is roller shoe number three. And this is roller shoe number four. Right, so these are four in number, right? So we have just counted and these are four in number. Now in front of it, you got two boxes. One box contain number three and the other box contain number four. And three is not the correct answer while four is the correct answer. That is why number four would be traced. So start with me, first of all, Stretch the line in the upper direction till you reach the top. Now, let's start tracing the correct number four. Start from the bottom and stretch the line till you reach the top. Now, let's start tracing the correct number that is number four. Start from the top and stretch the line in the downward direction. Now, make a slant line in the downward direction and make a horizontal line from left towards right. So we are done with the tracing of the correct number, that is number four. Now let's see what we have beside it. Over here, we got only one pony, right? So this is only one in number. And in front of it, you got two boxes. One box contain number one, which is the correct answer. And the other box contain number two, which is the wrong answer. So let's start tracing the correct number. That is number one. First of all, make a slant line. Now stretch the line from top to bottom to complete the correct number. That is number one. So we are done with our second row as well. Now let's see what we have in the third row. Here we got our favorite cupcakes. Right. So first of all, let's start counting and see that how many cupcakes are these. 
and then we have to trace the correct number in front of it. So this is cupcake number one. This is cupcake number two. This is cupcake number three. So these are three in number. These are three in number. And in front of it, you got number three and number two. And number three is the correct answer, while number two is the wrong answer. So let's start tracing the correct number. That is number three. Start from this point. Make a round curve and keep moving down. Now here again, start from this point, make a round curve and curve up slightly to complete this correct number that is number three. So let's start tracing the correct number that is number three. Start from this point, make a round curve. Now stop here for a moment. Start from this point again, make a round curve and then curve up slightly to complete the correct number, that is number three. Now let's move towards an other box that is beside it. Here we got very cute kittens. And first of all, we have to count that how many kittens are these, and then we have to trace the correct number in front of it. So this is kitten number one, this is kitten number two, this is kitten number three, and kitten number four. So these are four in number, so in front of you, you got two boxes. One box contain number four and the other box contain number five. So number four is the correct answer and number five is the wrong answer. So that means we would trace the correct number that is number four. First of all, stretch the line from top to bottom. Now make a slant line in the downward direction and line across from left towards right. So we are done with the correct number, that is number four. Now let's see what we have in the last row. Now in the last row, we got these roller shoes and then we have to count these first and trace the correct number. So first of all, count that how many roller shoes are these. So this is roller shoe number one. This is roller shoe number two. This is roller shoe number three roller shoe number four and roller shoe number five. So these are five roller shoes, right? So in front of it, you got two numbers. This is number five and this is number four. So number five is the correct answer and number four is the wrong answer. So with me, let's start tracing the correct number that is number five. First of all, make a horizontal line and now make a slant line. Start the curved part, keep going in the downward direction and now curve up slightly to complete this correct number that is number five. Now in this box again, we have these roller shoes. So we have to count that how many these are in number and then we have to trace the correct number. First of all, let's start counting from here. This is roller shoe number one roller shoe number two and roller shoe number three. So these are three in number. Now in front of you, you got two numbers, number four and number three. So four is not the correct answer since we have just counted and realized that these are three in number and three is the correct answer. So that means we would trace the correct number that is number three. Start from this point, make a round curve and keep moving down. Start from this point again, make a round curve and now curve up slightly to complete the correct number that is number three. So I hope that makes sense to you kiddos. First of all, you have to count the objects on the left side. After counting, you have to keep in mind what is the correct number of objects. Then you have to see that in front of it, where is the correct number written? For example, we have just counted and realized that these are five in number. Now in front of it, you got two numbers and we know that number five is the correct number and we have traced the correct number. Thank you so much, kiddos.